should be good, good race, though. though. Yes. Is that a word? It is now. Hi, we're back. Hello. With another exciting episode of the happiest hazards of Exponentially gaming. Exponentially exciting. Exponentially. Every second, you never know what's gonna happen. We might even find a Pokemon. Wowee! I need to heal. It's weird because we're playing Pokemon. We're playing Pokemons. You wouldn't, you wouldn't expect to find a Pokemon. I'll expect your Pokemons. Okay, so what were we doing? Were we trying to just make it through, or were we just grinding a little bit? We have literally been in this town for like four million years. I don't know. Come on, there you go. <laughs> oh, see, we went in the we went in the cave. Yeah. And then we spent like a million years in the bushes trying to catch a oh, owl. Yeah, an owl owlet thing. or whatever it is. An owlet would be a good name. I'm pretty sure it was named like. Dumb owl really kitty. Stupid, probably. <laughs> it's the new. It's the new. Owl Pokemon, the grass type starter, in the eighth gen. Huh. How about that? See, it's weird how I thought that was a cute name, and, like, it actually is a name. So, since we're a boy Dracula, is that a girl Dracula? Yes. Can we, can we suck the girl Dracula's blood and make it our... Our, our our Dracula wife. Our Dracula. I do want a Dracula wife. Go for it, Dracula. <laughs> Get her good. Oh, don't <laughs> kill her. Oh my God, he killed her. Well, how else am I supposed to? Maybe he's a gay Dracula. Yeah, he is a. Gay. <laughs> he's freaking. We should have named him Edward. <laughs> <laughs> Get another boy. One. There he okay. is. There's Edward. No, There's no, Edward right case, there. In that case, we don't need another. We don't need another boy Dracula, we need a boy, uh, werewolf. Oh god. That we can name, um... What was the other thing? You read Josh? Twilight. Josh? John? I feel like I'm way J off Jason. here. I don't know, I never read or watched any Shoot. of the Twilight. I read all the books and saw all the movies. Why? Why did you do that? Don't, don't ask... Why? Billy Jean, like, what the hell? What was preteen Billy Jean doing? <laughs> Obviously, reading a lot of Twilight. A lot of vampire smut. Actually, I was. I probably there was actually another vampire series. Oh my god! Of books that I liked way more, and I still I have and the entire And what was it called? A uh, blood, blood room. love, blood love smack card. I'll take hard. a picture, and you can you can insert the picture of my collection here. Okay, there it is. Wow. Looks good. Wow, that's embarrassing. Yeah. Only it's... like 17 books long. Jesus. No big deal. Do you ha Wait, is, was it was the picture of all of them? You have mm -hmm. all of them? I mean, it's not actually 17 books, but it's like 13 or 14 probably. I do have all of them except for maybe a couple runoff series. Oh yeah, you looking at my bed. <laughs> You're doing pretty good. You haven't died yet. I haven't. Man, have I gotten good Dracula? or what? Why are we leveling up Dracula? Uh, because that was your choice. You took a look at our motley crew and decided that Dracula was the cutest one. Did I? I'm pretty sure. Here's an instant replay. I mean, Who do we want to level up right now? Let's level up Dracula. He's kind of cool. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Would you believe it? I believe it. Um... Can I can I take a look at our crew right now? You and, can uh... take a look at our crew right now. Okay, well see. now we have the owl Pokemon. Do we? Did we see, actually before, get it? I don't think we had the owl Pokemon. Did we but actually now we get do. it? Yes, we do. <gasps> we did. We need see. We Yachi? need we need to be leveling Yachi up. Okay, that makes sense. I think maybe at the time I believed that Dracula was in fact the cutest. And the, but do then... we now have the owlet? What? Who is owlet. who is Yachi? Uh, she's the oh. upbeat, um, pre-manager of, uh, the Karasuno volleyball team in Haikyuu. Oh. Here's a picture of Yachi. She's really cute, isn't she? Yeah. I guess she's okay. I haven't seen her. <laughs> there it is. Ooh, fluffy tail. Alright, Yachi. Actually, switch, right? Yeah, we want to... I mean... 
You might be able to fight against him, but it's fine. It's this is fine. a better this is a better bet. Hey Genos. You got some big balls, Genos. <laughs> Get it? Yeah, four balls. <laughs> four <laughs> balls. <laughs> Uh, uh, there's some there's some jokes in there, but they're beneath me. I don't I don't even know okay, what. Okay, we have to fight this kung fu master that's in here. Dang it! Sweet. Hey, Grozard, you're so Grozard. Oh wait, uh, yeah, it's that makes me five, think. Though. That makes me think of the word that they use in um, Voltron. They they use the word quiznack. Oh yeah. And I'm not even sure what it's supposed to mean. Like, some of my friends told me that it would directly translate to fuck. However, many characters use the phrase, shut your quiz neck. So I'm not quite sure shut your fuck would make any <laughs> sense. Make sure to leave a comment below as to what you think quiz neck means. Alright, <laughs> so we have to fight this kung fu master over here. Wow. What? Oh shit! <laughs> I'm fighting a Pokemon right behind him. Oh. <laughs> All right, Yachi. I want you to go ahead and fight this guy. Use your charm power. Go, go on, charm him up. Yeah. Charm him up. Attack harshly. Fell. Use your peck. <laughs> Can't peck without a beak, right? Oh. Well. <laughs> Not necessarily. Use you scratch. It got scratched up. Okay. The attack missed. All right, Genos, you need to take over. Yachi's being a little bitch. You know how hard it is cutting through paper with an exacto knife. How hard is it cutting through paper with an exacto knife? It really shouldn't be that hard, and you wouldn't think it would be, but it is. I'm gonna wager money that it's not that hard, though. Well, you would be wrong. Go off balls. All right. So let's do battle with the mighty dude here with Ryu. I swore to never to leave this cave until I win one hundred consecutive battles. How many have you won to date? Zero. <laughs> Zero. Zero. Desu. Black belt Casey. He's got a manky. Um, I'd wager this is not a good matchup. Did we never catch a manky? Uh, no. I think we tried. Did we try? Actually, I I don't know. I don't oh. know. Maybe we do have one. Maybe we do. I feel like we do. Oh, but this really shouldn't be this hard, but it really fucking is. You're really having trouble there. What Billy's doing, if anyone's curious, is she's working on uh, her cosplay as as Diva, Diva dressed 76. up as seventy six. Here's a picture from that too, uh, what she's basing it on. Looks I've actually really only cute. found one picture of it. Yeah. <laughs> I searched the internet for a while, and this is the only picture of it, so probably nobody's going to know what's happening. But Right, but here's a picture of it again. It is super cute. I meant, like, at the convention. Like, nobody's oh, going to yeah. know. Wait, you're going to a convention? Yeah. What convention what, are you going to? Why would I be to? making a cosplay? I did it. I cut paper with an X-Acto knife. However, it took two swipes on the front and two swipes along the back. And then it kind of, and then you had to punch it out. So in case anybody never needs to cut a hole in a piece of paper, don't just just stab it with some sciver, scissors and cut around it. Because that's, that's freaking dumb. Some wisdom there, people. You can apply it to your life. Well, you know how when you're, like, in kindergarten and they're teaching you how to cut shit? Because they're like, you're in kindergarten and you're a dumb shit, so you can't cut things. And so they give you all these papers with, like, shapes. And they're like, cut these out with some scissors. And then they give you, like, this super difficult shape. It's like a, it's like a circle, and then there's, like, a circle inside it. And they're like, hey, cut out the middle. <laughs> Without no. cutting into it. You never had to do that? No. We just, we just cut whenever we needed to cut. But what about when you have to cut in the middle of a piece of paper? I don't know. You figure that shit out on your own, kid. Usually, you poke a scissor, like one of the scissors, through it, and then you and then you cut around it. But it never it never turns out well. It never turns out clean. 
I, I, I don't know. So use a box cutter instead. Yeah, because they totally have box cutters in school. No, I'm just saying, <laughs> when you're at home and you're over the age of whatever, like seven, I'm sure an eight-year-old can, like, use a box cutter, right? Probably. It's possible, I mean. Hmm. <laughs> Man, this just reminds me of Mount Moon, that cave that sucked so bad in that one game. All the Zubits. All the Zubits? All the Zubits. It's just like, I constantly have to come back out to heal up. Because Pokermans. Thank you. Restore them. Yes. Very much so. Arigato. Gracias. Don't we hope shit. to see you again. You yeah, probably yeah, yeah. will. You probably will, bitch. Don't tell me that that is where the cave opens back out to. Oh, no, no, no. It's another entrance. Derp. I was going to say, stupid. I can just hop the fence. Oh, stupid. You're stupid. Yachi's already level six. Yup, leveling up fast. Gonna have to get out of here soon, though. <sighs> getting pretty tired of seeing these Grozards. Me too. Somehow I find that it's fun to randomly beat up on innocent trainers. Oh my god! Yep. I suppose all bullies eventually get their comeuppance. You're not a bully guy. You're a freaking psychopath. Hey, <laughs> ladder. Am I out? I'm out. Right on. Now talk city. Sweet! This guy's gonna give me trouble, isn't he? Oh. Welcome to Now Talk City. I'm the official town greeter. Well, doing a good job, I guess. Sweet. 